In this video, we will learn how to clean puppet valve in turret. When the spindle runs, coolant absorbs heat and reduces friction between tool and workpiece for smooth material removal. If dirt or chips gets trapped around the puppet valve, it can restrict coolant flow and cause uneven cooling, affecting component surface finish and tool life. In a CNC turning center, coolant flows through the Y strainer and three-point manifold, splitting to tool turret and spindle top junction. This design feeds coolant only to the active tool. The puppet valve traps particles and stops flow during indexing. The valve button is easily replaceable. Both Y strainer and the puppet valve components work together to filter chips and control coolant flow. First, make sure the machine is turned off and safe to work on. Tools required puller, spanner, allen key and air gun. Remove turret top cover to access puppet valve. And by using the allen key. Remove other wipers covers in case necessary. Loosen the grub screw near the slot on the coolant tray. Here we are using M5 puller to access and carefully pull out the puppet valve outside. Inspect the valve and surrounding area for any dirt or buildup. Then clean it thoroughly using a soft brush or air gun. Check out wear and tear on the o-ring and face of the puppet. Replace if worn out. Insert the puppet valve with the grub groove aligned. Then tighten the grub screw to lock it in place. After insertion of puppet valve, Tighten the grub in order to lock the puppet valve in place. Remount the sheet cover on the turret body and put back all other covers removed earlier. By following these steps, you help ensure reliable operations to extend the tool life of your CNC equipment. Subscribe for more CNC tutorial and share your results in the comments.